from the city that doesn't sleep, doesn't stop drinking, and doesn't stop for pedestrians, live from New York's Get a Life Stadium, it's Threats Football. I predict a high body count and a lot of shattered limbs today. Yeah, my last game here, my brain got battered, spilled all over Manhattan. To live in this town, you gotta be tough, 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 tough. Hey, what I'm the teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for MFL action. The New York Tyrants go up against the New York Threats. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Yo, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? It's time to turn on, tune in, and get your mutant buzz on. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here. It's MFL game day, and you know what that means. Yeah, the town will be in flames tonight, and half the city's population will be sliding down greased street poles and eating all-you-can-eat horseship buffets from the curb. Yes, victory can be bittersweet sometimes, Bricks. Let's see if the home team can light up this town like a Roman candle. And it's first and ten. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Third and two. like a freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. And it's first and ten. He blasts it and picks up seven yards right there. I'm a house camel and silo. I am a hell and all silo. Second and three. It's a sabotage. Man, he just laid the wood on him on that one and knocked the ball out. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. The 10. Touchdown! And he rips off a game-breaking run for the score. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. Oh, man, talk about running into a buzzsaw, Bricks. Okay, he just ran into a buzzsaw. Second down and two. gonna hurt he may not be able to comprehend math after that hit what's math exactly and it's first and ten
Second down in a lot. Some yards with pinpoint passing. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. And he snags the punt. And oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. This about a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. First and ten. And he pulled out about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. He is running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. If you don't hear it coming, it'll knock you right on your down. I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Second down and more than the QB would like. It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to place a bat. Second down in a and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. for me. 
Third down and forever. He had it for a second there. And they'll line up for the punt here. And he put all of his foot into that one. Nice catch, and he turns on the after. Oh, you see that saw, Bricks? He never saw that. I saw what you saw. A saw you never saw. See, there's the saw there. I see. First and ten. And that's how you get your buzz on in the MFL. Man, I'm two fists into this bottle of scotch. And that'll be second and eight to go. for a first down. And it's first and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. Bricks got more kills than anyone in the league right now. Yeah, you make a good point. Great chance for a big game. But still not enough for a first. Even I'm frustrated, and I'm a team agnostic. Well, oh, I hope the kicker ate his bleedies this morning. Looks like the QB had some issues with the ball placement. Spikes out, spikes out. How many times do you have to tell that idiot QB to hold the ball with the spikes out? A nice pickup for six yards. Second down and four. Defense was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Third down and three. And that's why they call it the money shot. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. Normally that would be a first down, but he had a whole lot of ground to make up. Second down, the size of brick. And we're at the two-minute warning. Second down in inches. 
looks like Thor. Devastating hit, knocks the ball loose. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. He's at the 40, the 30, the 20. He's at the 10. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Looks like he does have some turkey skin wrapped on his backside from that bad Bernie hit last year. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. First and ten. The quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. See that boot, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. And he runs it for four yards. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? And that'll be their final timeout. And it's first and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. It's anyone's game as the third quarter begins. Both teams have taken their performance-enhancing drugs, and everyone is ready to rock and roll. The teams line up for the second-half kickoff. Hey, man, I was on schedule now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> when you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Flimsy 
Lindsay Lohan's nose hits a mare in Lost Wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. They've used a strawberry field's dirty trick. <laughs> Those guys don't know which way. Well, that's a real buzzkill. Oh, with a brutal hit. Second down in a very lot. And that's a sack. The quarterback has to get rid of the ball there. Third down and never going to happen. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Pow! With the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Hey, guys, this isn't funny. I swear to drunk, I'm not God, but seriously, stay in drugs, eat school. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And that'll be second down and four. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. And that'll bring up second and one. Second down and long offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. The kicker should make this, but you know how it goes in this league. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. It's a 
six yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. First and ten. Call man about a six yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. And that'll be second down and four. run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Third and four. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, bigger than yours. No one was going to stop him. That's two points. team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> and it's first and ten. First and ten. No, well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. That's the end of the third quarter. This game is going to come down to the wire. I love that show. Third down and ten. Running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. Got to keep them guessing. And it's first and ten. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Oh, <laughs> no. 
Well, little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Oh, man, he really wants it! And it's first and ten. Looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. Second down and ten. First down. And it's first and ten. He's super. You know what they say? Sometimes the. Oh, and he took a leap and. <laughs> Catching up! Joke, job, do something! Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey! <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? First and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. Ten yards. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now and is going to try. Ouch. Anyone in the mood for steak tartare? First and ten. One speed engaged. When he tried to place it there, and he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can see that, Grim.
Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. To speed things up, the offense goes into a two-minute drill. And that play went nowhere fast. No game. Second down and ten. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. They use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A uh, bit pessimistic, don't you think, Southwind? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point. And drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. <laughs> Touchdown! Be all in my own world, poor me. That's why I be well, two years ago, this guy was a bear at the edge of the galaxy. And today, look at him. He's a dancing scoring machine. What a story. What a, what a wonderful story. I only we really have it. Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. Side kicks the desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a possession. Stealing ain't right, Glenn. It just ain't right. He's leaving it all out on the field today. And there's his large intestines over there, his liver. I think his spleen is stuck on that guy's cleat. No, that's a gallbladder. Ah, uh, my bad. Drill, which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stupsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Guns. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. And same as Brick's ex girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I and he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grip. And that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of that constant, relentless advance? If only... And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting, or dead, or worse. Second down in a mile. Third down and the offense needs a miracle. There's a huge gain, and this offense is rolling. Margaret, that was a pass play. Rolling plays are in both. Another painful loss for the French fans today. New York.
Scott goes down in defeat. And let's go down to the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Oh, that personality disorder has a name. It's called autotrumpism. Uh, okay, thank you. Come on, I'm just gonna go get him out of here. Britton Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhar Corporation. They get it right every up.